I decided that I was going to do a before Briarfest collection tour slash barn tour. Um, so I can show you guys what it's all like before we go to Briarfest, and then I'll do a more detailed barn tour after Briarfest. Um, I'm just going to kind of do an overview of everything right now. But, um, yeah. So we're going to get started with the horses on the shelves. So, I did get some new stalemates from my last barn tour. Um, I got the Best of British set, I think is what it's called. It comes with this little guy, little silver pony, and these all do not have names yet, so. This is a mare, little mare pony. Um, then I also did a re-sculpt on this guy, girl, it's a girl. Um, it's my first ever re-sculpt, so I don't think she turned out terrible, but not the best. Um, I'll try again some other time. But that's my first ever re-sculpt, so yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, it also came with this Clydesdale back here. It's a pretty dark bay Clydesdale. So he needs a name. And then it also came with this little Shetland pony. He's really cute too. He has like the black on his tail. And that is a gilding, so that is a male too, so. Any name suggestions, that'd be great. And then these are all of my stalemates so far. I'm not gonna go into detail with them. That's just a quick little overview. So, um, I also have two classics up here. Oh, I don't even know if that one's Briar. And I'm not a classic collector, so they're just kind of randomly in my collection. Um, I also have the Rocky Mountain Horse, um, Gemma Twist, Scarlet, Blaze, and Ferrari. And then I also have my most expensive model up here, um, so far anyway. He cost me $100 and he is the 2014 Special Run Bon Fetti. That's how you say it, I'm not entirely sure, but that's how I'm saying it. And he's my baby, I love him so much. Um, he only has one flaw, or it's not really a flaw, I think it's like a scratch or something, and it's like on his eye over here, but it's not like on his eye, it's beside his eye, so. That's the only fly I could find on him. And then I also have American Pharaoh that usually goes here, but he is not in my house right now. He is somewhere else in the pasture. Why not? Seems like a good place to start. So in my little pasture, you see the gate there. It's a real working gate. Um, we have Luna right there. Um, we have Rose. That is Luna's mother. And then back there, trotting around, we have Prince. And a nice green grass. Um, and then in this barn, um, I'm not going to turn the lights on, but there's lights around. That's Elizabeth, and she's petting Clover. And then back there is Willow. Um, and then right there, that's the dog spot. So yeah, that's them. Um, and I'll just give you a quick little look around the barn. Like I said, I'm going to do more detailed video after Briarfest. And then in there is Melody. That's Prince's mom. Then we have a bench and some flower pots. And in there is Shadow and Dark Sunshine. Um, Shadow is the Tennessee Walker. Since you can't really see her, I don't really feel like bringing her out. And then Dark Sunshine. I made a gilding again and he's in there. He's the Starlight mold, I think. Horse? I don't know. So you can see his little white blaze in there. There's Sports Stall. And in there is Autumn. Pretty girl. And then there's some more storage up there. My blankets. Uh, my, some of my blankets I have packed away to head out to Briarfest to bring models home in. So you can see the opening to Rose's stall there. Storage shed there. Jump storage there. Um, and then look around this barn and in there we have Electra and Raven then we have Summer and our hot walker and then right here is Obsidian Pretty Boy and then Lauren and Oreo the dog oh and there's Stripes and Legion to our two cats um, going around here, we have our cross dye wash stall area with Chance and um, Jake, I think I named him. I'm not, I don't really remember. It's either Jake or Austin. Those are the two names coming to mind. And then we have um, 
this girl. She does not have a name yet. Um, I really do want a pretty name for her because I really love this horse. Um, she's one of my babies. <laughs> yeah, I really, I just really love her very much. Um, so I need a really pretty name for her. Her stall and whatnot. Um, and then we have Rocky back here. And before I do my after birth with Barn Tour, I am going to build him his stall. Then there is, um, what's her name? For some reason I can't remember that rider's name, but she is getting out Isaac. He's back there in the corner. He's a pretty boy too, I like him. She's grabbing his halter and stuff. There's Phantom Stall. Then back here in this pasture is Indy. Then we have Phoenix up here, one of another of my babies. Love him to death. And then we have Hickstead here. Uh, Pong, table. And then there's a quick look at our feed room, and a quick look at our tack room. I'm hoping to get more saddles and stuff from Briarfest, but I don't know. Um, and then we have our trailer and truck over there. You can come over here, there is um, Emily and Phantom. She's just tighten up this girth, I guess, and I don't know, she's doing something. <laughs> Over here we have our newest barn that I did do a DIY, do it yourself, yes, DIY. <laughs> um, but I do need to finish it because this wall is not finished. Everything else is finished except this wall, so I gotta finish that before the after breakfast barn to random playmats right there. And there's our Jack Russell who does not have, I think I named him Rascal actually, no, his name's Rascal, the Jack Russell. Um, man, that is Nikki and Ashley and she's petting her horse Bravo and that is also her horse Romeo back there and these doors actually do open on hinges I'm really proud of this barn it's like my favorite barn I have even compared to my briar barns I love this barn um and he has a little hay rack over there and I need to make him one and then I need to put hay in both the racks so yeah so this is what the other wall will eventually look like. Um, I also have to re-glue this because it fell off. So, yeah, work in progress. These guys are dusty. It's because I never do anything with them. I've just been so busy. You can tell I've been so busy because the horses are dusty in their stalls because they never move. Um, I just bought this cross-country jump at um, a, not a tax store, a, it's called Horse Progress Day. Um, I bought it there little cross-country jump really cute and there's our sign I guess I should have started with that but there it is and then there's sport and what's her name Paige I'm pretty sure that's Paige and then the last two horses are over here we have two no names um, I do need names for these guys and they're adorable they're the 2015 holiday horse or 16 2015 2015 holiday horse horses so that's them. And then, little stuff. and then over there are two more no-name horses that I need names for. Um, the two Andalusians. So yeah. That is my before Briarfest tour. It took ten minutes and I tried to go as fast as possible. <laughs> well, I guess not too fast, but... Yeah, so, um, I'm really excited to see you guys at Briarfest and I'm also going to be doing a video on what I'm going to be doing, where you guys can see me if you really care. <laughs> but yeah. So thanks for watching guys, bye!